Hello my fantabulous grade 1 students and welcome back. Today we're going to start with the first week of explaining the theme how we organize ourselves. And we agreed that we're going to talk about communities in this theme. So, let me remind you that co a community is a place where the same people work, play, learn, and solve problems, and live as well. So, we are going to talk about communities. We are going to discuss all the concepts related to communities. So, where we live, a community is a place where people and families live work and have fun a city is a big community with many people we live in a city we live in a man right a man is part of a bigger community which is jordan right but our community is our city and if we want to go smaller we live in neighborhoods a man is made up from a lot of neighborhoods right so each one of us live in a different neighborhood. Some people live in the same neighborhood. I might find two students or three living in the same neighborhood. And I might find two or, or three of them, live, of them living in different neighborhoods. But we all live in the city of Amman. Is a town the same big as a city? No, of course. A town is a small community. It has fewer people than a city. It has fewer cars. It has fewer buildings. We are going to talk about the difference between a city and a town in this video as well. Now, we agreed that we live in our community, which is the city of Amman, which is our neighborhood. If we can go smaller and smaller and smaller, then we are living in our neighborhood. But what do we do there? We can see a picture of a neighborhood, guys. We can see different houses, different buildings. Maybe there is a supermarket in there, a hospital, a school, a police office, and a lot of buildings, right? We can also see different cars. We can see a bus, which are transportation methods in our neighborhood. But the, what do we do in our neighborhood? We live there, right? We work there. And we do everything. We play there if there is a garden in our neighborhood, right? So, what do people and families do in a community? Let's look at these families. What do they do in a community? Each of these families has a mother and a father and their kids, right? The father might be working as a doctor while the other father in the other family might be working as an engineer. The third may be a pilot. One of the mothers might be a house wife, while the other is a teacher, while the third one is a nurse. So each one in my community, each one of these members of this community and families do their own job, right? So what do we people and, ma and what do people and families do in a community? They do different things, right? Do we live in a town or a city? What do you think, guys? Yes, we live in the city of Amman. Excellent. Where do families go to shop for food? Of course, if I want to go buy some food in my community, I will go to a supermarket, right? Or I can go to a restaurant. Now, let's check our understanding. Where do we go when we want to check out books? Where do you think, guys, will I go to check out books? Will I go to the garden, to the cinema, to the hospital, or maybe to the library? Yes, excellent. To check out books, I might go, go to the public library in my neighborhood or to my school's library. Excellent. 